Hey y'all, welcome to another video from Reckonow.com. I got some feedback on my surf fishing cart that it's not easy to find a used you know, aluminum cart or to weld aluminum for that matter. So I'm showing you how I made a previous cart I used from just a garage sale cooler and some rod holders from Walmart. I think this will be a little more accessible to most folks uh, if you don't want to go all out and uh, build an aluminum cart. If you read my previous post on fishing Gulf Shores, this is actually the cart we were using last year and it worked just fine. It doesn't roll quite as well in the sand, but it definitely does the trick. It actually worked better as a pier cart or maybe a catfishing cart, but you can definitely make it work in the surf. It's made up of five rod holders and an igloo cooler. And each rod holder is attached and epoxied, or actually I should say I use marine goop, uh, to make sure it's waterproof and you don't lose any of the, I guess, properties that allow the cooler to stay cold. So all you need to do is use each rod holder as a template and drill some holes. And using some stainless hardware, just take a fender washer and a nut and just attach it on the inside. So I'm going to show you how I do one and then we'll kind of blaze through the other uh, four holders. But just using a drill and, and um, a wrench, you can tighten each of these up. And then use you know a, a rod holder as a template to do the other four rod holders. Uh, you do need to be careful. Uh, if you're using long butted rods, you'll want to put some kind of stop on each rod holder. And that way it won't drag the ground when that the big butt of the rod is pushed through the holder. Then you just take some marine goop and apply it to each nut, and that's really all there is to it. Uh, it works quite well. Like I said, we've used this in the surf in the past, and I uh, hope it helps you if you can't uh, build an aluminum cart. Thanks, y'all.